Well, I was just coming back from the store and I saw these three guys. So I'm going to get them on the trailer. Uh, maybe get the, uh, unfortunately, the snowman isn't going to work. But the penguins are okay. I'm going to use them. And I have another Santa that was in the box if you watched my last video. And it's going to work. I'm going to get these three guys on. We'll be on our way. I picked up these two batteries and guess what I got another one right here that's three batteries in the same alley we got our first scrap of the day some pretty good scrap some bed rails of a different kind oh, come on okay great we have parts of a water heater but no water heater maybe they took that I don't know that's weird huh. well they got a wooden high chair and some metal stuff here ah, and a baby bed ah, this is nice baby bed you know what uh, it's a lot of good scrap metal but I'm gonna leave it uh, and the reason why is this is a very nice baby bed and if I take the springs and the rails it's gonna be completely useless so better for someone to take it that's gonna reuse it right it's aluminum framed Coleman table here didn't have so much stuff already on here I could have taken that uh, crib to goodwill but it would get messed up in my trailer everything does all right there right there pre-lit Christmas tree yay The box, box is a little bulky here, so I'm just going to uh, pull it out of the box. It's a nice tree. Okay, what place this one? Screen's here. We had a little rain last night, so the ground is a little wet. I thought this was going to be a nice find, but this glass, this uh, mirror, and I don't want the bad luck that goes with breaking mirrors. Well, it's already broken, right? So, still, whoever enforces that uh, broken mirror uh, bad luck policy might get confused. We don't need that. Okay, going pretty good. That's one of those shoe rack things. Lightweight, uh, not a whole lot of metal in one of these, but Oh gosh, it's falling apart too. I'm gonna have to uh, break this down a little bit to keep it from flying out.
Okay. Oh man, got wet from the rain last night. Really wet. That was a nice uh, car seat. That's heavy, and we got a table. Huh. That might be something. It looks like a an autographed uh, piece of artwork. Nicely framed. Uh, who are these guys? Poker players? Two pain. The mighty mighty Bastonis. Pay attention. I don't know. That's kind of weird. Hi. We're gonna need to get that on back here. Hopefully everything will be all right. Looks like it. Get that on. Hey, okay, got that on. Had to put Frosty up in the front, but I'll move that back over here some. Ah, okay. Looking good. Gonna be decorations and stuff. Halloween things. Oh, not everything. It's all in these nice totes too. We'll have to go through those later. And this, I don't know what this is. Some kind of a heater or something, a few dehumidifier, probably not working, they never are, but it makes good scrap. We could use some totes. We can combine some of these. Oh. Nice stuff. Legos. Oh. oh, for a second I thought it was a, a Peppa Pig Lego thing. Well, Okay, oh. D 
decent stuff. Hey, okay, I got some good stuff here. An older type of high chair. Sooner or later, you gotta let that stuff go, right? And as we all know, the best time to let go of your scrap is when Scrapper Sam is looking for it. Kind of an interesting little cart there. And I... Miscellaneous bird feeder stuff, a miscellaneous sign, Gauge or something. Uh, that's just some pieces of hose. suitcase but this broken chair will do just nicely I have a lot of chairs at least uh, I would say half a dozen chairs on the trailer today uh, where's a good place for this one half a dozen chairs <sighs> at least our first fan in quite a while like an umbrella but uh, it's heavier it's all uh, a lumber blade and the rest of the umbrella thing found all this uh, that's a heavy pizza pan or something and a lot of a lot of uh, aluminum cookware here so we're gonna get that on put that in the cookware place
I think most of this is aluminum. It's all scrap though. I definitely need to put another extension of my wall here. Uh, that'll be my next trick. Oh, here's some more pans. And miscellaneous stuff. No idea what that is. Is that some kind of torture device? Cafalon. That's a good brand. Oh, and a license plate for my collection. I don't think I've got an apportioned plate. I think apportioned is like for the large trucks and stuff. They have a, a portion of plates. Uh, there's a couple of things here. We got this wire rack. Just take them both. You can ride up front with me, and I think that's about it. Oh, well, yeah, we can get this metal broom handle. All right, not bad. Oh, his. Is that a microwave box or a microwave box? All right, that'll help with that. Okay, nice. really time for scrap in this area but if they're gonna put it out I guess I'll pick it up I'm like less than five minutes from my house so I want to get this loaded and then I can uh, ha, reload it a little bit later. I don't want to do too bad a uh, job of loading this up, but. Huh. All right. When I get home, Santa's, Santa's gonna have to have a new place to stay. This is empty. Oh, that's heavy.
All right. Everything unstrapped and ready to go. We're going to start unloading. They got a, a space all cleared out for me here. Ah. That's a nice table. I like that table. We had quite a few nice things uh, on this scrap run. Could have even had even more, but darn it, we have such a small trailer. Probably going to end up keeping a few of these things, but not a whole lot. That turned out to be super heavy. Park here. How's it going? Hold it all right. Hold it up all right. Oh yeah. That's good. That's a pretty good load. Yeah. Good to see you again. Yeah. Yeah. 
Wow. Huh. I'm trying to get mine unloaded here too. I knew if I came a little earlier, I'd run into you. Got a, huh. Oh yeah, yeah, definitely. Oh, well, I'll let you uh, get there. I'm, I'm only about halfway done. You want me to hold your camera for you? I can hold your camera for you. Get some action footage. Oh, okay. Oh, my, my wife is, uh, I'm gonna send her a picture of this. <clears throat> That's uh, like a, a $2,000 massage chair. The massage chair there. But she's got one. It's not a big deal. checked out at the big scale uh, $43.40 for our 620 pounds of shred I still have some copper the batteries and stuff like that I'm gonna hold on to those when uh, I can bring in some other stuff but pretty good haul for uh, for that um, <clears throat> did get to meet up with Santiago I'll uh, put a link to his channel uh, he's a, a scrapper here, uh, one of my friends at the uh, the scrapyard. Uh, he's in and out a lot, and uh, we did get to talk not as much as we want to because we both have to get back and uh, get more scrap. But uh, finally got to see him. It's been a few weeks, and uh, wow, it's really good to meet up with people that you know and, and get a chance to uh, talk some. Anyway, that's it for uh, for this episode. I will talk to you guys again soon. Scrapper Sam.